48-year-old Brian Dodaro, a public works employee for the city of Troy, as well as a volunteer firefighter charged with nine counts of first-degree criminal sexual conduct. We've got eight life offenses, and um, plus an additional charge. If I'm concerned about protecting the public, if I'm concerned about the dangerousness of the accused. We're looking at a pattern of behavior, allegedly, that took place over five years. Dodaro placed on leave from the city and fire department. His accusers only recently felt empowered to come forward. It was reported by multiple witnesses that the defendant had followed them or showed up at their place of employment to keep tabs on them. Uh, this is concerning as a repetitive pattern of behavior, Your Honor. Dodaro's attorney denying those allegations. The evidence here is weak. Um, and wow. These are I, I think I heard earlier that you had no uh, no police reports received. Is that correct? Well, it's, these are these are 11 to 16 year old allegations. I heard right. what the detective said, Your Honor. I heard that there was no media evidence. There can be no physical evidence. So aside from allegations, I'm not sure what else there could be. I would suggest that that is weak evidence. Uh, Magistrate Holt's response. There is, ample, there is significant evidence um, that corroborates um, statements that were made. All right, that's my understanding. Again, these are allegations, counselor. I, I think I appreciate you bring, pointing out that for your um, client, but my job is to help protect the community. Dodoro's bond set at $250,000. If he does post bond, he will be put on house arrest with a GPS tether, no access to the internet or the alleged victims, and he will still be allowed to go to work. Reporting in Troy, Scott Walchek, Fox 2 News.